गुड मॉर्निंग ऑल ऑफ यू इन टूडेज लेक्चर आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ एरिस्टोटल स्लेंटर्न अ स्पेशल च्यूइंग अपरेटस फाउंड इन माउथ ऑफ समाइनोडर्म्स सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल लेट्स फाइंड आउट वाई वी कॉल इट एरिस्टोटल लेंटर्न एरिस्टोटल स्लेंटर्न एज आई टोल्ड यू इट्स अ स्पेशल च्यूइंग अपरेटस फाउंड इन माउथ ऑफ फ्यू अकाइनोडर्म्स दैट बिलोंग्स टू क्लास एकाइनोइडिया लाइक सी अर्चिन एंड सैंड डॉलर्स कुछ अकाइनोडर्म्स लाइक सी अर्चिन और सैंड डॉलर्स के माउथ में ये एक स्पेशल अपरेटस है जो उनको फूड को च्यू करने में हेल्प करेगा इसको सबसे पहले एरिस्टोटल ने डिस्क्राइब किया था इसीलिए इसका नाम एरिस्टोटल स्लेंटर्न वाई लेंटर्न क्योंकि इट रिजेंबल अ लेंटर्न और लालटेन इन स्ट्रक्चर ये एक लेंटर्न को एक लालटेन को रिजेंबल करता है इसीलिए इसका नाम एरिस्टोटल स्लेंटर्न है अब इसका स्ट्रक्चर क्या है इसके स्ट्रक्चर में आपको यू कैन सी पिरामिड्स टीथ एपिफाइसिस रेडियाए एंड रोटुले नाउ सी इन द नेक्स्ट डायग्राम देर आर प्रेजेंट फाइव पिरामिड्स विच आर नथिंग बट ट्राइंगुलर कैलकेरियस प्लेट्स दैट मेक्स अप इट्स बॉडी सो फाइव ट्राइंगुलर कैलकेरियस प्लेट्स विच सराउंड ईसोफेगस एट देयर बेस दीज आर कॉल्ड पिरामिड्स pyramids are connected to teeth towards mouth so five plates which are made up of calcium and triangular in shape are called pyramids they have teeth around mouth pyramids are five in number and teeth are also five in number see another thing there are two sets of muscle you can see around aristotle lantern protractor and retractor muscles now i told you there are five parts we have seen pyramids we have seen teeth now epiphysis radii and rotule this is another view you can see pyramid and teeth on the lower side now see this view the purple color area is pyramid and the pink color muscles are interpyramidal muscle which join adjacent pyramids even teeth are also visible towards mouth towards esophagus see this broad bow shape area this broad bow shape area we are calling it epiphysis see another view this is aboral view of aristotle lantern in aboral view you can see five bow shape structures called epiphysis which are present on the broader sides of pyramids you can see even five radii or compass and five rotule there are five rotule and these rotule they join to form a circular opening by their inner ends and this opening help in exit of esophagus dekho jo yellow wala area hai wo esophagus hai aur just around esophagus see rotule are joined the inner and inner ends of rotule join to form circular opening for exit of esophagus so five epiphysis five rotule and five compass or radii they are seen in this view so aristotle lantern is made up of five pyramids five teeth five epiphysis five compass or radii and five rotule now how does it work i told you it consists of two sets of muscles protractor and retractor muscle so these muscles help it to move with the help of muscles the structure can be partially protruded and retracted through the mouth it can move backward as and forward as well as side by side and you know these movement forward and backward movement and side by side movement help it to tear off its prey or algae teeth are there which help in chewing of food so this structure is somewhat unique found only in few echinoderms again i am telling you in sea urchin and in sand dollars and this structure help them to feed upon their particular food significance is written it help in feeding of sea urchin and sea sand dollar it enable sea urchin to scrap algae or prey and teeth help in chewing or grinding the food particles so this special structure described by aristotle and resemble a lantern we are calling it aristotle's lantern so thank you so much this is all about today's topic and